Surah Yasin, chapter of the Quran, chapter 36, ayah 1. Look, look. if we go to the tafsir, we will understand what the word Yasin means. Yasin. Yasin. What does that mean? Let me prove to everybody. Let me prove to everybody that Allah is a human. Those two letters mean Allah is a human. Watch. What? <laughs> no way. Yes. These two letters in Arabic means Allah is a human. Watch. Watch. I hope the website is going to work. Is the website working? No. It's down. Do you see it, guys? It's not working. Let's see if I refresh. Guys, the Saudi government website, this website is uh, the owned by the Kingdom of uh, Saudi Arabia. Uh, I think they forgot to pay the bill. They are out of oil money. You see, I'm, I'm using Ibn Kathir, Tafsir, but it's not working here. The database has issues, so I have to use the Jordan Kingdom website, owned by the Kingdom of Jordan. <laughs> Let me go to uh, that website. They forgot, yeah, they forgot to say, inshallah, this is their, why their website is not working. And they forgot to pay the bill. Again, chapter 36, ayah 1, uh, Ibn Kathir. Let's see if we, if we get lucky. If we get lucky, we might find it on this website. Let's see. Let's see. I hope I'm going to get lucky, brother. Look, guys. Again, this is just to show you guys. Chapter 36 of the Quran, Ayah 1. Tafsir Al-Quran Al-Azim by Ibn Kathir. Ibn Kathir. Again, Tafsir Al-Quran Al-Azim. Ibn Kathir. Okay. Now let us go to the most important part. Look what it says here. An Ibn Abbas. People, who is Ibn Abbas? Who is Ibn Abbas? Christians, who is Ibn Abbas? Who is Ibn Abbas? Christians, if you've paid attention, who is Ibn Abbas in Islam? He is the ink of the Ummah. He is Tarjaman al-Quran, the translator of the Quran. He is the cousin of Muhammad. He is Hibr al-Ummah, the ink of the Ummah, the cousin of of Muhammad himself. The tafsir daddy of tafsir daddies for the Quran, right? He's not a joke. If you call him a liar and deceiver, basically uh, you're calling one of the main guys who is explaining the Quran according to Muhammad. Go to him. You're calling him a liar and deceiver. Watch what Ibn Abbas, for example, saying. An Ibn Abbas, radiallahu anhuma. Wa ikrama, ikrama. Wa adhaak, the smiler. Remember the smiler who said, uh, uh, "I was born after two years." He, the guy, this adhaak said, uh, the smiler with the teeth. He came out of the womb of his mother having teeth after two years. So his mother carried him in her belly for two years. That's that's the same guy. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the same guy. Wa'al Hassan, wa Sufyan, and then so on. Inna ya seen bima'na ya insan. Oh boy. According to all these people, we copy that, we put it in Google Translate just to show you what the text is saying, guys. I'm only using Google Translate to show you what the Arabic text is saying. An ibn Abbas, radiallahu anhuma, wa ikrama, wa dahaq. والحسن وصفيان uh, and so on إن إن ياسين إن ياسين بمعنى يا إنسان these two highlighted words يا إنسان what does that mean on the authority of Ibn Abbas may Allah be pleased with them and Ikrama and Al Dhaq and Al Hasan and Sufyan that ياسين in chapter 36 ayah 1 chapter 36 ayah 1 this ayah what does that mean it means Oh human, oh man, oh human. Do you see it? Oh human. It turns out that Yasin 
means all human and it's one of the names of Allah. It's one of the, of the names of Allah. Here is my translation again, guys. Tafsir ibn Kathir for chapter 36, ayah 1. On the authority of Ibn Abbas, Ikrama, ad dahak Hassan, and Sufyan bin Uyayna, that Yasin means all human. Rob, is this one of the names of Allah? Yes. Right? This is, look guys, Hua, look what it says here, Hua, Ism min Isma Allah Ta'ala. This Yasin is one of the names of Allah the Most High. Wait, copy it again. We put it here. Is one O oh, human is look O oh, human being is one of the names of Allah. Huwa ism min asma Allah Taala. Uh oh, so Allah, Allah is a human being, Rob. Yes, chapter thirty six, ayah one. Allah the human. Now I understand why Muhammad said, "This is Allah." He looks like a young man with curly hair wearing green clothing. Green suit. Huwa isa min isma Allah ta'ala. Exactly, Phil Herrera. If Phil Herrera just put the Arabic, huwa isa min isma Allah ta'ala. It's one of the names of Allah. O human. O human means one of the names of Allah. Uh oh, uh oh. So Muslims, from now on, don't say uh, there is no God. Say there is no human like Allah. That's your shahada from now, right now. From now on, say there is no human like Allah. That's your shahada. The first part of the shahada: there is no human like Allah. When you take your shahada again next time, say there is no human like Allah. Okay, Muslims, pinky promise. Muslims, pinky promise. Are you going to keep your promise, Muslims? Pinky promise? I know you're going to keep your promise, right, Muslims? I just showed you from Tafsir ibn Kathir. Thank you very much, Rob. Let us continue. Again, guys, if you want to get the transla <laughs> translation, take a screenshot because this is my own personal translation for Tafsir ibn Kathir, Tafsir ibn Kathir for chapter 36, ayah 1. Take a selfie, take a screenshot, use it in your debates with Muslims. 